Sister Wives Cody Brown charging big bucks on side gig to pay bills. I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers. Welcome to my shocking news channel. Recently, Sister Wives stars, Robin and Cody Brown put their large home up for sale. Now, an insider gives the reason why. Furthermore, Cody is promoting and charging big bucks on his side hustle to pay off his bills that are adding up. Sister Wives Robin and Cody Brown are making changes. While, the new season of Sister Wives is zooming closer, Robin and Cody Brown are facing some financial strains in their current life. Cody, 55, is at a new stage in his life where he is back to having only one wife but still has connections to his other three former wives as well. Undeniably, they are intertwined for life since Cody had 18 children with four wives. With their home for sale, there has been speculation they are heading back to Utah. But other issues at play may have forced their hands on the matter. Since Robin and Cody Brown added their mansion to the market, an insider has come forward to discuss why. When the couple listed their beloved 4,476-square-foot home for $1,650,000 unexpectedly, plenty of information has been swirling about the reason for the decision. An insider told The Sun that the reason behind the sale is they are struggling to afford the home. The insider said, Cody and Robin listed their home because it's become a huge expense that they no longer can afford, especially now with the family torn apart. Furthermore, the source adds, they haven't done any work on Coyote Pass because of how much it will cost to build and, of course, stopped their plans altogether once the wives left. With all the bills adding up, Cody and Robin are shifting their efforts to make money to cover expenses. In response to the financial needs, Sister Wives star, Cody Brown seemingly is pounding the payment to get more money flowing in. For instance, he is promoting and charging big bucks for his side gig. Correspondingly, Cody will offer fans a few moments of his time starting at the rate of $149 to get a message. Lately, Cody has been promoting his Cameo account, where he will give his celebrity love to those willing to pay. Unmistakably, the platform offers fans options to receive personalized messages for birthdays, holidays, or special occasions. Furthermore, he advertises providing messages that share words of encouragement, or offer advice on relationships and parenting. Cheekily, he also adds that he will show off his signature dance moves and more in videos for the right price. Although Cody shut down his account after Garrison Brown's death, it is back and booming now. While no one can blame him for taking a break to process the grief, his return to the platform makes a statement. Before Garrison's passing, fans could pay as low as $10 for a message, but now his Time comes at a much higher price. Seemingly, the significant increase suggests he wants to make it more profitable. Additionally, some people believe the theory Robin and Cody are liquidating their assets to pay their bills as well. With Sister Wives Season 19 only a few days away, TLC releases teasers to help whet fans' appetite. During a new Sister Wives preview Cody, Robin, and Christine Brown have an awkward run-in. The clip shows how they choose to proceed with each other. After their divorce, Sister Wives' sticky situations. Undeniably, the tensions are heating up this season with three of the Sister Wives heading in new directions. Since Mary, Janelle, and Christine couldn't see a future with Cody and Robin Brown, they chose to leave the plural marriage. Small actions over time finally built up and they decided it was no longer their calling to stay in the spiritual union. However, even with the split occurring, there are times when they will have to be together. In the newest preview, fans get a glimpse of one awkward interaction between Cody, Robin, and Christine Brown. On Reddit, someone posted a new preview for the upcoming season of Sister Wives. Likewise, on another thread, a user says, Sister Wives, Christine has awkward run-in with Cody and Robin, exclusive. Within the clip, Fans get to see Christine Brown Woolley talking about seeing Cody and Robin Brown at a party for one of the kids. Since they are forever tied as parents, there will be plenty of occasions for them to be together. In a confessional, Christine says, Yes, I noticed that Cody and Robin were at one table and I was at another. Admittedly, she states, I'm not going to necessarily say, Hi. 
The scene continues to show how the parents coexist in the same room but are struggling to figure out how to act around each other. Christine continues by acting out a conversation, how's it going? How is everything? But, she knows it wouldn't be how she truly feels, that would be disingenuous. And that would mean I was going to be friends. After that, she makes it clear she doesn't intend to foster a friendship. Continuing, and friendly, and I'm not. I'm not going to be friendly. Sister Wives stars Cody and Robin Brown are struggling. Furthermore, Cody Brown reflects on the situation in his own confessional. He says, I think Christine's in a good place because she's moved out, she's moved on. However, that isn't the case for Cody and Robin Brown. Admittedly, Cody says, Robin and I are really kind of in a struggling place. After flashing back to the last remaining wife playing poker with Cody, Robin gives her thoughts on their relationship. Robin says, we're probably doing the worst we've ever done in our marriage. It's been tough. It's been tough between us. Furthermore, she asserts, he doesn't know who to blame. Himself or one of the other wives. Empathetically, Robin says, Cody's feeling a lot of rejection. And so I think he's kinda looking at me going, are you going to reject me too? And so I'm on my toes. I'm having to consistently make sure that he is not sabotaging our relationship. After the initial post, several Sister Wives fans gave their thoughts on Christine Brown Woolley's decision to be standoffish to Cody and Robin Brown. I'm glad to see Christine not pretend to play fake friends. Also hope none of the kids are trying to convince her to these days. He owes those three women the biggest MF apologies before he should get even the fake niceties from them. By the sounds of things the only person who was possibly trying to broker peace was McKelty and that ship has sailed. I was actually really disappointed in her for that. There is no harm in being friendly for the sake of making the children feel comfortable. As the child of divorced parents who didn't speak the entirety of my adulthood. I can honestly say that she's making their lives more difficult. While some Sister Wives viewers discussed the interaction between Christine, Cody, and Robin Brown, others were ready to confront the blame game. He doesn't know who to blame. Tears of joy Robin I think we all know what you really mean there is. He will never admit that he is to blame so I'm gonna play dumb as usual and claim he just doesn't know. Obviously she doesn't blame herself. He doesn't know who to blame, himself. Or one of the other wives. Lady, you are so transparent. Just by not including yourself in that list, do you somehow think that the viewers are excluding you as well? You dot asterisk and well know that the OG3 plus OG13 blame you at least partially. Why is he blaming anyone at this point? This is now fall 2022. It's going to be another season of blame with the most tragic ending. I'm fascinated by what she actually thinks about her role in all this. I don't buy a word she says but I really can't tell if she's totally clueless completely in denial or the most manipulative person alive who has been plotting all this all along. On another thread, someone adds, like you sabotaged his relationship with the other wives, and their children. Seems heathy. She has moved on. I think emotionally she broke from him years ago. Cody is exhausting. I can't imagine maintaining a relationship with someone like him. He is the center of the universe. Everyone must center his feelings. Sister Wives star Robin Brown has been criticized for years due to her unfair relationship with Cody. Many viewers blame her for the downfall of the family. Three of Cody's wives left last season. The upcoming season 19 will feature the aftermath of Christine, Mary, and Janelle's departures. Many are also curious if Garrison's death will be shown in the season as tribute. But it seems something happened, which may be best not to be shown on TV. TLC recently released a preview clip for the upcoming season of Sister Wives. It features Cody and Robin's struggles after the three other wives left. In one of the clips, Robin said Cody is sabotaging their marriage after all the splits. They have all betrayed me. Cody frustratingly said in one of his scenes before saying, I am out of my mind. Robin tries to comfort her husband, but she can't deny the fact that Christine, Mary, and Janelle's decision to leave affected her marriage with Cody. I feel like the idiot that got left behind, she added. Robin caused a scene at Garrison's funeral. 
Some Reddit users recently reacted to one of McKelty's conversations with a fan from a different thread. The sister wives clarified that they don't lie about anything, but they've been trying their best to say what they can while also respecting family members. She then admitted that they've been very supportive of Robin. But things have changed lately for them. According to McKelty, Brown Padron, the things that happened during the recent funeral are some of the main reasons why things are no longer the same for them. We won't be talking about those events, she added before thanking the fan for being concerned and showing support for their family. Meanwhile, many people got curious about what happened behind cameras, as Robin Brown appears to have caused a scene during Garrison's funeral. Holy St. Robin causing a scene of any sort at Garrison's funeral would be the absolute last straw for me. I wonder if it was less of a scene or some comment along the lines of how sad it was Cody wasn't closer at the time to help him. Like, if she had a chance to hint that the separation was the other wives and kids' fault and that was the cause of this, she totally would. It wouldn't take much for her to go way too far. To turn McKelty against her, number four must have done something horrific. I wish someone would share what happened at the funeral. I'm so curious as to what R did to make McKelty be done with her. It was also reported that Robin and Cody recently listed their Flagstaff home for sale. The two-acre property was rarely seen on the show because Robin didn't want to film inside. It boasts five bedrooms, four bathrooms, and a garage that could fit four cars. The price tag for the Flagstaff home is $1.65 million. It's unclear why the Sister Wives stars are allegedly selling their property. But several people think they're trying to downsize as they start to feel the consequences of not having Christine, Janelle, and Mary's financial support. Throughout the years, Sister Wives has highlighted how the Browns love the Christmas holiday. Although there were tough things at times during the holidays, the family seemed to enjoy getting together. However, when COVID-19 hit, the family's tensions were heightened and everything became strained. Sadly, Season 18 Episode 2 brought out a big point of contention in the family. First Logan Brown tried to start a text message thread with the siblings to get an idea of what everyone thought about having a Christmas gift exchange again. However, it spiraled out of control quickly. When Robin got wind of the discussion she used her communication skills to try to organize a Zoom call but there were many frustrations from the family. Since she was getting pushback she gave up but took the issue to heart. Unfortunately, there were too many hurt feelings to have a simple text conversation around the family discussion. However, an impromptu Zoom call was too difficult to organize on the fly with multiple time zones and young kids involved. Now the Christmas text fallout is finally explained. On Reddit, Sister Wives fans discuss the infamous Christmas text that started a rift in the Brown family. What exactly was said in the Christmas gift exchange family group text? Anyone got any info backed by evidence or trusted sources? What do you think about this video? Please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video.